Hi, this is EMA. I'm at Amoeba Records. Stoked to be here, and I'm about to show you what's in my bag. Fuck. The first thing that I got and looked for it was a uh, record by Meredith Monk, and there were actually a ton to choose from, so I had a very hard time. I'm guessing on this one, I bet it's gonna be good. It's on Zadik, which is John Zorn's label out of New York. Say what you want about him, but Meredith Monk is awesome. This is one of my favorite records of all time. It's really not very cool to reference, but it's so sweet. This is the first George Thorogood and the Destroyers record from 1977 put out on Rounder, and there's some really awesome songs on it. Scratch my back, baby. It's almost like Kraut Rock, what he does with the guitar. It's like 10 minute jams with, with lots of guitar shredding, and it's just really almost Rony, but also kind of country. Rad record, definitely recommend it. Okay, back to our awesome ladies. This is not only one of my favorite records, one of my favorite record covers. Lori Anderson, Big Science. This record kind of helped me understand the 1980s in a way that I never did before. Uh, it's got, of course, O oh Superman on it. So hold me on. And you're on my Feels like this record is about now, even though it was released in, I think, 1984 on Warner Brothers, no less. Okay, this is Street Hassle. I love really long songs, okay? So Street Hassle, if you haven't checked it out, I think there's a pretty rad video of it on YouTube. I'm really stoked to have this. And there's no one here now, and there's nothing left to say. And look at how good he looks. Almost as good as her. Also have Wanda Jackson. I love her voice. Everyone had always talked about her voice, and I never heard it, and then one day on the radio, I heard it, and I was like, who is this? It's Wanda Jackson. I know it's been out for a while, but all the songs in here are so great. Lil Wayne, The Carter Three. To you forever, from me to you. I heard somebody say, Judge, I'm gonna need a suit. I know that the Carter Four is gonna be coming out soon, but I figured, let's check this out, you know? It's, it's, I think this is one of the classic records of our times. Moving on from there, I wanted to pick out a seven inch. I wish I had more time to go through all these because there was fantastic stuff there. So I was like, okay, well, let's just pick out like a crusty seven inch. Um, so here's this. I also really like this picture on the back. It's a picture by Diane Arbus, and I think actually, maybe Tyler, the creator, also jacked this recently, so it's, I love the photograph. <laughs> so that's another reason, if you're getting a beautiful artifact, might as well love the way it looks too. So not only is there CD and vinyls and tapes here, there's also movies. I really want to check this out. This is um, two live concerts by Nico. What would take that because I've heard rumors of how she was live, but I've never actually seen it. So here we go, Nico, an underground experience plus heroin. All right, I went through the tapes. You got plenty of tapes here. I mean, I gotta get everything. The 50 cent tapes, I mean, how can you go wrong here? Got the vinyls, which of course they're hit when I think about you. I touched myself, thought this was a really cool song. I was about 14. Okay, I thought I'd check out some, some LL Cool J. Not necessarily familiar with all of his work, but I assume that this is probably his preferred format. Okay, let's go around the world. I really like um, North African music, so uh, I wanted to find some comps that could maybe I could be introduced to some new stuff. So I found this in the comp section. It's from Morocco. And the I guess, you know, they speak French there, so we got some liner notes in French, so I'm not totally sure what this is all about, but um, I bet it's going to be sweet. <laughs> and
And just in case I would want to, you know, kind of know a little bit more about what I'm getting here, it's Tanarawin, which is also, I think, from, I don't think Morocco, but definitely, I think, somewhere in North Africa. They're pretty rad. You got a picture of a Vox amp on the back, so they like to plug in. They like to do long songs and like to play a, I don't know what that's made out of, a kitchen sink, literally, looks like. Uh, the last thing I got, <laughs> my mom used to play a lot of Tchaikovsky for me when I was growing up, and I actually don't know any, like, what to get. This section's pretty big, so I was like, is there like a best of or something, Tchaikovsky? So this looks kind of like a best of. So I'm gonna check this person out see if I can get inspired for some more long songs and a lot more sounds to kind of round out what I have. This has been EMA at uh, Amoeba Records here in Los Angeles and I just showed you what's in my bag. You never see